mga kabroha sa atong real estate as part-time job part 2 Okay, what koy lingaw atong ipadayon ang atong uh, gitakol atong iaging adlaw about real estate. So, sa katong mga viewers nga wa pa nakakita o gusto mo tanaw sa atong part-time job, uh, just click subscribe and hit the notification bell para ma-notify ka sa akong mga future nga mga videos. So, last time guys, uh, nag-talk ta about accreditation no? of how to be accredited kung ikaw gusto ka magpa-accredit sa anywhere in the Philippines uh, into a real estate company. Sa first video na ako, makita ninyo dito kung sa ang mga steps na, uh, from ikan sa pagpili sa the best company nga yung Fugland and then down to the last part which is uh, uh, application for a license sa PRC and HNUR. Aka bro ha, atong storyahan ang inyong mga worries. Okay, as a first timer sa real estate, uh, being an uh, international property investment specialist or agent, uh, nagyo tayong mga worries, no? Uh, Pareha sa kuha, no? Okay. Katumbag po pa ko sa real estate, nasa ito mga worries. Worry number one, kaya nga, kung saan ka nakapagkahalin, no? Uh, first time pa man ako, eh. So, uh, dili ko kabalo mo market o mga condominiums dili ko kabalo mo market o mga houses no? uh, tapos maana din ka nga being an agent is far beyond my expertise uh, far beyond my course no? guys ako engineer magani ko nag agent ko so kaya sa mimo no uh, don't put your worry in your head okay if imo lang sige ko na hunaon that dili ni mo kaya kay dili line sa imo ang course dili ni mo kaya it's because uh, wala ka nag study ani nga the field but then ma realize ra na ni mo sooner or later guys if you will start now to you mga kabroha uh, in our company most of the members are licensed professionals uh, we have doctors we have nurse we have teachers uh, even if they have this profession they made a choice not to join with sa mo ang uh, company uh, Cebu First Realty Ventures decide sila nga magpa-credit, it's because uh, they want to earn an extra income even though they, if they have a full-time job so, makarealize kang uh, kana nan ni appeal sila ani o why not mo join ko no and then, probably uh, dagan sa tua, wala nakabalo about ani na sideline, about ani na part-time job and then some of you guys already know about it but you are hesitant or you have many worries na, uh, you have worries in life na inyo ang giatubang it's because uh, you are afraid of being rejected no, rejection is now uh, number one na siya kung ang imuhang choice is dili fit sa ila so, so first na reject sa imuha imong family of course imong relatives no magapil-apil pa gyud sa way labot mo na sila mga rejection and then no mo to kung gingon uh, most of them are licensed uh, professionals and then uh, sila po is mga owner na po sila o condominiums owner of mga houses uh, diri sa Cebu 
So, imagine yun yung mga ni Apil Manggani sila, mas kidato na sila. How much more kita ng mga pobre, magpabiling pobre kaya ako. So, so, i-visit lang ako ang first video about aning real estate guys na ara dito sa ako ang profile no nasa kong channel. So, first, i-subscribe sa me and then don't forget to hit the notification bell para ma-notify ka sa ako mga future videos. Number two. So, ato ang worry number two guys is uh, rejection uh, from the people around us. First is ang ato ang family. And then, second is ang ato ang relatives, ato ang friends. No? Um, sa ako walang mainon guys, no? Kay ni Agi naman dun ko ano mga rejection sa own. Okay. It's, it so happened lang na ang una ni Richard sa ko is ako ang family kay kay nanu daw mag agent ko na dili man siya in line dili siya para sa ko ah. so so how will you conquer this rejection no? kay kung dili ka mo fight ang na rejection madala din ka sa ilaha, madala ka sa kahit madala ka sa ilahang decision of not to enter this kind of uh, business so what I made is I proved to them na makahalin ko in one month time I proved to them and then uh, katong time na nakahalin ko uh, that's the time na na-prove na ko sa ilaha na naajuday income din sa real estate uh, kung magkugi lang yun ka naajud siya kadungan and then din sa real estate man ko wala siya yung membership fee magpa-accredit lang ka wala yung bayad orientation wala yung bayad matay na ka, ka ng free trainings and seminars so, wala yung bayad plus maka-income pa dyan ka nga nung di ka ma-appeal diba? so, next guys worry number 3 ay, dili ko kabalo kapuyan ko mo market dili ko kabalo sa auto start so, to answer your worry guys about this no? kay issue mo ganyan sa padaghan dili ko kabalo nga nung mahadlog ka na dili ka kabalo well in fact naaman tayo mga trainings and seminars aside from that itrain mong po ka sa ato mga mentors itrain ka sa iyo mga leader nga mo invite ni mo no, they are very much willing to help you in all the process like uh, computation kung di ka kabalo mo tanah si buyer na pila man di equity ani so uh, so wala ka balo guys equity is uh, the same term with down payment so we are very much willing to help you about this na mga kuan uh, topic like uh, computation mga equity equity monthly payment payment scheme mm. We are very much willing to help you guys, and for me as a leader of leader, also I am very much willing to help those who are in need of this kind of assistance. And then, aside from that, no, uh, I can say that experience is the best teacher. Bili ka makalearn once the experience ani mo sa on paghalin, on sa on pagnegotiate o clients, uh, on sa on para mas mapadali ang uh, pagclose sa deal. No, I will separate this topic guys sa uh, closing deals and uh, negotiating clients as uh, separate topic. Uh, I will make a video separate for this, and then I will make video also separate uh, like how to compute no uh, payment terms na na. and then yes i will make that sa inyo ha, para sa inyo ha, guys basis ninyo sa on ninyo pag start sa kanila business
down with your worry guys so some of the worries uh, natubag na nako no uh, may it be personal so add na po ta sa developer nga side so okay mo market man ta og properties condominiums houses so we need really to study the developers na sa side sa developer uh, i mean so unsa ona to pag study um, the whole thing about developer so first Get to know your developer. Background check. Uh, how many projects they completed? Uh, what projects they completed? Then, how many years naga exist ang ilahang project? Uh, get to know also of their current projects. And then, mainly, who are their clients sa kanang project and then uh, aside from that is uh, learn to study their payment scheme and then uh, get to know also about uh, their incentives and as well as their commission releasing mo na sila mga uh, items ang imo ang studyhan about sa developer na aspect giving you these assignments for those sa ato mga aspiring agents sooner or later no uh, in God's grace no nganong gihatag na ko ni nga mga assignments no to get to know better sa inyong developer nga gi market na na. Okay. to be honest guys nahitabo na rin siya sa some of our agents no na magpataka lang og market o mga classic classing mga properties well in fact wala pa sila kabalo on sa background ani nga developer kung the very good ba nga developer kung kung sa commission dili ba ni sila mudagan dili ba ni sila kana lisod mo release o commission kay mo na siya na daghan mo good ang daghan developer niya na na fly by night no na developer ka ron pero pagka uma na close na di ay mga paasa mo na siya mga paasa nga developer ang tawag na so so sa pag sa kato guys ng mga items na ako ang ipachag sa inyo ang ipapakroon chat kung matubag to ninyo tanan no pila na sila ka years na exist ang kanina developer kung matubag na nimo kung uh, tugay dugay na dahil sila o nga uh, as, as per sa mga research kay kanang they are multi awarded developer and then when it comes to incentives kay mapaminawan na na nimo um, during sa ilang product presentation or kanang PKS product knowledge seminar no and every developer guys magkandak na sila product knowledge seminar or training no um, that's the time na you will get to know about their properties or current projects na ilang din market then sometimes we will talk we will mention also those projects that they have completed so that's the time that you will decide that this developer is very good or not. This developer is the best or not. So, yeah, when it comes to commission releasing, incentives, kung koripot ka ayo, di mo atag incentives. So, move on to the next developer who will give justification, who will give justice sa imuhang effort o sa imuhang uh, knowledge sa pag percent sa inyong client, sa pag-site tour sa inyong client, no? Na na. Um, uh, uh, don't be jack of all trades na tanan na lang na uh, bisag tanan na developer imo ang i-market, no? Pagpili o ko ay uh, uh, developers na mga maayos, ako ang apart, uh, I choose uh, developers for condominiums, three developers for condominiums that I would like to market, and then at least uh, three developers also for uh, house and lot nga ang akong i-market. Uh, I will not market any developers because 
mawadaan ko o focus. So, at least 3 condominiums nga developer, 3 house and lot nga developer. Then, I can focus on market, marketing no, sa kanina mga projects. So, muna siya naka-advantage. So, uh, I would share also what are the tools kung saan mga gamitin para maka-market ko. Uh, first, you can utilize Facebook, of course. No? You can market face in Facebook na dira ang mga marketplace ng mga kana uh, house and lot for sale na dira mga groups no but in order na di lang pud kaayo lata si ko at si Facebook no you can do vlog no post post nimo sa Facebook also post nimo sa YouTube sa imong YouTube channel no pwede ka ana and then pwede ka mag flyering no personally you will go anywhere, no, like a resort, uh, which uh, nahimo na nanako. You, you will go to bar, uh, you can meet new friends, foreigners, and then, uh, those are the tips that I can share to you. Uh, sa ako ang experience uh, on how I made uh, those sales. So, mostly of my sale is uh, condominiums, man. So, so if you encounter problems uh, if you are an agent right now and encounter some problems if you are beginners right now feel free to to message me uh, feel free to comment uh, on this video no? and then and then if you are successful enough and closing your first sale then be thankful because uh, more closing deals will come to you after that the first sale is memorable because it will unlock your next sale well, that's it for tonight no uh, I would like to say goodbye God bless and good night and then don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the notification bell uh, right here and to be able to be notified sa ako mga next videos. Thank you and bye!